All right, welcome back to LearnWire. We're going to be looking at this tool that I've been using the last couple of months, and it's called AlsoAsked.com. Uh, this is a keyword research tool, but it's going to be doing keyword research in a very specific way, and it's very unique to tools like uh, SEMrush or Ahrefs or uh, even SE Ranking. Um, those are the big tools that allow you to do com competition analysis keyword research, uh, keep track of your rankings and just do um, everything under the sun that you need with SEO. But when you start coming into needing more unique keywords and easy wins, it becomes more difficult when you start doing all that research and you're dealing with a million keywords and you're really trying to just find keywords that no one else is creating content on or and so forth, right? So what also ask does is that you're basically able to go out and if we went and typed in something like into Google, how to start an organic garden, an organic vegetable garden right here, you're going to see right over here that people also ask, there's going to be all these questions that people are starting to ask that have to do with this initial question, how to start an organic vegetable garden. And you can bet that Google knows when people ask this question, that they also um, a large percentage of them are starting to ask these questions over here, what is the best soil mix for organic vegetable gardens? This is our, our organic vegetable garden that we're interested in, right? They know that we're new. They know that we're not going to know the best soil mixture to use. And that's why it's starting to be, um, it's going to offer these questions down here. And if we click on this arrow and then we click back up, notice we don't have just four anymore. We have one, two, three, four, five, six. And then if I click on it again, we're going to have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So every time I click on one, it gives us another couple. And then you can see that this starts becoming, you start getting a lot of keywords that you could go with. And these, this, this is one method of getting some quick wins with your blog, especially your new blogs, is to start answering all these questions right here. Specifically, you're going to be able to build that topical authority and uh, relevance and, um, and knowledge graph, so forth, right? Um, so what this tool does, it's going to do all this on autopilot and automation for us. And we can take this main keyword right here, and we can go into our tool over here, um, also ask and this is at also ask.com there'll be a link below if you want to go check it out uh, there is a free trial and so forth and it's pr uh, pretty affordable before we go out and use the tool uh, we'll go and look at the pricing I already have um, like if I go to billing I don't want to show that right now so I'm going to go ahead and log out of my account so we can go and look at the pricing real fast. So I logged out and then now you can see you're going to be get three three free searches um, a day um, or yeah, I guess until tomorrow. So I'm going to go click on the pricing and, uh, you can get this in different currencies right over here. Um, but we have the basic is a hundred searches a month or three per day for every 24 hours. Um, and then you have your light right over here and then you have your pro over here. And I believe I am on the light version where I get 300 searches per month. You have unlimited users, so you can uh, set other accounts up with this, like your VAs and so forth. PNG in, uh, image export, uh, CSV. The problem with using the free version, it's just not going to work for like for my purposes. Um, I was trying to use the free version and it was just so annoying that I couldn't export it as a CSV. And I realized that it would take me an hour to copy and, and write all the terms down and, and all that. And it's just, I, you may as well subscribe if you're going to use a tool. And that's how I uh, do my business. And so I went ahead and just subscribed. And I've been holding this uh, for a couple of months, just haven't had a chance to do a, a review for you guys. If you're going to use it heavily, then um, even at six, $59 a month, it's still, you know, half the cost of um, Ahrefs and SEMrush. Um, but I think that most people will find that the thir 300 searches a month and the $30 a month plan or $29 a month plan will work really, really well because you're going to get the deep search uh, ability and then you're also going to get the CSV data export. Okay, so I'm going to go and log back in and do a quick demo for you. I haven't used the tool in a couple of weeks, but you can see we definitely want one of my websites. We've been I've been doing a lot of um, software type uh, keyword researching and so forth. Um, now what you can do is you come in here and we're just going to throw something like that in how to start an organic vegetable garden. You could go broader with it, which is just best basically vegetable gardening, 
or you know organic vegetable garden um, but i'm going to go ahead and um, see what we can do with getting very very specific right here you can do a deep search we'll do that next time it's going to add an additional four credits um, but i'm just going to go like this on the surface and say search and see what it's going to come up with us for us it's very very fast too and it's just a very easy tool to use so you can see it's going to give us this layout right here we can scroll in we can scroll out by the mouse right here if we click on one of these plus buttons it's going to take it back up to the top as a search um, button um, as a new search if you will right so if i click on this it's just going to take that back up here what makes a vegetable garden organic it's going to go and uh, continue and do that search for us right here and you can see as we scroll in you'll see the zoom percentage right there but you're going to get a whole new set of um of how this breaks it down now a couple of different ways you can do this is you could create what is the meaning of organic and you could create a really giant po pillar post on this and you could answer all these questions inside of here you could almost use this one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve you could throw all those in as h2s and make this one big giant um pillar post under um, what makes a vegetable garden organic and maybe that could be a category or something like that right well there's different different ways of looking at this right you could really look at this and that's always a debate i've even been in conversations with seo experts on this there's no um direct answer it's always going to say depends um on if you should write every single one of these as a post um or is should this be one giant post right so you have to decide that yourself but a lot of times what i'll do is i'll come in here and i'll zoom in on the questions right here how do you prefer soil um, how do you prepare soil for organic vegetable garden is water considered organic um, so these are um, pretty far apart um, as far as the questions i don't think that you would want to include all these and talk about them only briefly if someone's asking um, how do you prepare soil for a garden that's probably going to be a post in itself so in general i tend to lean towards all of these being a post so let's go back up here and just say um organic i'm going to just say organic vegetable gardening right here and i'm going to go and do a deep search it's going to really um, do more research and i'm going to push search and then i'm going to show you how i've been using the tool and just keep in mind the deep searches will take longer if you don't do a deep search then it literally comes back in about maybe 20 seconds or less but as you can see that took a lot longer but the cool cool part about this and then you don't get this in the free version is look how many uh, keywords that this tool just brought in for us this is insane and these are going to be all of the people also asked questions you can build an entire website and dominate a niche just using this tool uh, because we're going to keep scrolling up here and you can see that we have all kinds of keywords uh, to go after and you can technically it's going to break it down into different categories so each one of those could be a category um, and this could really be the category structure um, of your website and all of the different posts on this organic vegetable gardening site right here um, and you get a png right over here but i download the csv and this is what you don't get in the free version that um, if you were going to go and try to copy um, you can zoom in on here you would have to have a notepad on your other screen and this would take you a couple hours to write all of this down and then you'd have to transfer it or you have to write over into a notepad on your other uh, screen and you're just i mean if it's if your time isn't worth a couple hours right i would rather just pay for it and get this dispensed as uh, or exported as an excel file and then now what you can do is come over here and just double click right here and uh, i'm going to go ahead and do an undo on that actually um, right over here you get the answers so it's actually giving us like an ai answer which is really cool um, you could possibly even use this answer as one of the very first things you put in your blog post um, you do get an answer which is super cool but generally speaking column a is going to be what you're going to be most um, interested in and notice down here we have got 511 keywords that are all very very long tail keywords so this is the absolute best way to do long tail keyword research because these are going to be um most of these keywords are going to be uh, uh you know phrases or questions or keywords that um, are not going to register in semrush or ahrefs and so you're going to be missing out on a lot of 
things that people really do want to know and that people are really actually asking. And so you could start off and literally build your site around this. And then you could start going in, you know, like obviously organic vegetable gardening, uh, you'd make a pillar piece. Um, for that, but you know, you're not going to rank for it, right? But then when you start answering all these other 500 um, questions right here, that's when you really start being able to uh, gain that uh, trust and that uh, topical rel um, authority, right? Um, it does give you a site that um, gives the best answer as well. So a reference, you could even send this over to your writers and say, Hey, you know, here's the answer. Here's the question. And here's some research already. Um, you can go and start writing an article on that, right? Uh, page title, or you could just plug these into AI and like agility or koala or something like that and go to town and start writing these um, you have your page title right over here and you have your tiers over here as well so this is a great way to get a lot of key words uh, in a very short amount of time and this is going to be um, most of these when you type these in like what is the difference between organic and non-organic gardening we can copy that and we could go in um, and just go start checking some of the um, keyword difficulties on some of these keywords right over here. It's going to show up as uh, zero or um, just e uh, easy, right? And we can go over and just get some more real quick just for fun. Here's a good question someone's asking. And you can see that these are all no like search. These are not go registering in, but it doesn't mean that people are not searching for them. So um, this is a really cool tool. Very, very easy to use. Very simple. Not a whole lot of settings and things that you can do. It's just very simple. It's going to go out and find all these uh, 500 keywords. It's going to find a bunch of different keywords for you that you can go out start building these content around answering these direct questions that people are um, also asking and start ranking your content and having some quick wins. So hope you guys enjoyed this quick review on um, also asked it's at also asked.com. You can go click the link below to go check it out. Sign up for a free trial. If you like it, I suggest signing up for the pro version at $29 a month. So you can download the CSVs and you can start getting all these unique keywords that you're not really going to be able to find in very many software. So I really, really like this tool. Uh, highly recommend it. I'll see you in the next video.